just gonna take that juice and you can thicken up your juice if you want to I'm actually a little lazy today so we're not gonna thicken this up okay we're not gonna thicken it up but what is a popping today welcome or welcome back to my channel the channel's name is Yaya's catering I am your host Tish my name is not Yaya's that's my daughter's name you guys always call me Yaya but anyways welcome or welcome back you guys if you are a new subscriber thank you so 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 much if you are OG family am What's good? What's popping? Thank you so much. I appreciate all you guys' support. Love you all. Hit the subscribe button because the math ain't mathing when I'm looking at my analytics, y'all. A lot of y'all is watching, but a lot of y'all will not hit subscribe. It is free. It is free to make an account. It is free to subscribe, you guys. So listen, today, y'all, I got the taste for some turkey wings. I have not made turkey wings in a minute. I had to taste for it. So peep this, okay? Now, y'all, I looked in my freezer, Mitch Mac. So I had two, um, I had a pack of two wings. Here go turkey wings, right? So I had a package with two of these in there. And then I had a package with two of them in there. So I'm like, I gotta cook. It's all good. It's all turkey. We gonna cook it all together. We just gonna work it out. Mind your business. Stay out of mind, okay? It's gonna work out. But listen, y'all. I already went ahead and washed my um turkey off. So now, easy. I'm not gonna hold y'all long. Like I said, I know y'all busy. Y'all got things to do. So now what we about to do, you guys, we gonna season up this good old turkey. Now I'm using my all-purpose seasoning because my all-purpose seasoning has... 14 different herbs and spices in it okay it is very com complex and this is all you're gonna need if you do not have my seasoning I mean you can just like use your favorite seasoning you know what I'm saying you could use uh, garlic powder onion powder however you like to season your food season it um, but if you want some of mine you could go right to yayascatering.com order you some or you can download our app in the Google Play Store so you guys I'm gonna season again my turkey with this um, all-purpose seasoning and I'm also going to sprinkle it with a little bit of all-purpose herb seasoning because I feel like herbs and turkey just go together so well so y'all let's get right into it let me put on some gloves season up my turkey and um, I'll be back to show y'all the next step on how I slay my turkey wings all right YouTube fam I'm back I sprinkled my seasoning on my turkey wings this is what it is hitting for before we mix it up so now you guys I'm gonna go in with some onion. This is just a regular, regular white onion. I got them cut pretty thick because they are just gonna cook down and be so delectable in this dish here. So I think that's all I'm gonna use. You know, feel free to use as many onions as you want, okay? And again, this is just a regular, smeggler, degular white onion nothing fancy now I'm about to hit y'all with something that y'all probably gonna be like what the what the what the what I like to have fun with my food I like to introduce new flavors to my mouth and I stumbled across this little idea years ago I am going to add in some hot banana peppers now a lot of people like to add in um, bell peppers I like bell peppers, but I don't really like bell peppers on my turkey wings. I just like that simple onion with this, you know, a little, and then this uh, banana peppers is going to give it a little twangy slangy. It's going to give it a little twangy langy. Now, also, what I'm going to do is somebody calling my phone, y'all, my bad. Hold on. Y'all know I give it to y'all raw. What I'm also going to do is splash it with some Worcestershire sauce. Yep, get your life. Stay with me. Stay with me and get your life. Splash, splash. How much are you using? I need measurements. Uh, Y'all know I don't measure. Okay. Now, 
I'm going to say it was a probably about a tablespoon and a half, though, if I got to tell y'all something. I'm not, I, it's about a tablespoon and a half of brisket share sauce, if you want to use some. So we got the banana peppers, we got the onion, we got our beautiful seasoning. Um, I'm also going to sprinkle on there a little bit of that McCormick poultry gravy, lifesaver. Oh my God, now they call, hold on y'all. Jeez Louise, I'm in the middle of a video. So boom, poultry, gravy, lifesaver, delicious. We just go sprinkle a little bit on there. A little bit, a little bit. How much are you sprinkling, Tish? I would probably say this, I'm going to sprinkle two tablespoons, okay? Now what you want to do is the obvious. I'm not doing bell peppers. I'm not doing uh, I'm not doing green bell peppers. I'm not doing yellow, orange, none of that. I don't really care for them in my turkey wings, okay? So I'm just gonna incorporate all this good stuff. I'm just gonna incorporate all this good stuff. Ooh, all this good stuff. Look at it, y'all. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me. Let me bring one up. That's what it's hitting for. I'm probably gonna hit it with a little tad bit more seasoning because y'all know turkey is just like blizzizand. I mean, turkey ain't got no flavor. So let's go in with a little bit more of my seasoning. Just like that. I'm just gonna work it in. Work it in. Work it in. Work it in. You could do this the night before too. I'm pretty sure them joints would be crazy good. Um, if you uh, season your your joints, your turkey, the day, the night before, and let them joints marinate in the seasoning. Wowzers! So y'all, all I'm about to do is just fill this pan midway, midway now, with some uh, water. Let me turn that over. See, and then I'm leaving some onions at the bottom because I'm telling you when it start cooking all them juices go fall to the bottom and focus camera all them juices go fall to the bottom and it's just gonna make them onions and them pe oh my god this stuff it's just it just makes me very happy cooking makes me happy okay so now you guys if you have, y'all probably gonna hear some noise in the background because I got a disrespectful puppy. I love her with all my heart though. So listen guys, if you want to use chicken um, stock or chicken broth or turkey stock or turkey broth or vegetable stock or be, if you have stock, use it. I don't have stock. So I'm using H2 to the O and it's gonna come out spectacular. So let me fill this with some water and like I said guys I'm just going probably like because you don't want to submerge your um, turkey you just want to put a little have them in a little bath there so I'm probably gonna put it right where my finger is probably about right there you guys I'm gonna cover it with aluminum foil and I'm gonna put it in my oven which is already preheated to 350 degrees listen y'all because y'all be just y'all don't be watching a whole video or y'all be asking the same questions 350 degree oven right now everybody oven is different you might got to go 375 you might got to go 345 I don't know what I'm doing with my oven okay I'm doing 350 covered and I'm gonna set it and forget about it and I'm gonna come back and check on it in three hours that's what I'm gonna do so when I come back in three hours I'm gonna show you guys what it's hitting for and then I'm gonna let y'all know what the next step is you know what I'm saying uh, after that so love you guys stay tuned see how these joints come out it's turkey wings for dinner tonight holla Alright, YouTube fam, this is what the turkey wings are looking like. Wait, when did I put them in there? Three hours later? Three? What time is it? No, four hours later. It's three and a half. Listen, y'all, it's between three and a half, four hours later. Sorry. But this 
is what they are hitting for. So there is our juice down there at the bottom, that beautiful juice. And I'm just going to base these guys. These are definitely tender and done. They are definitely tender and done. Um, should I break open? I should probably break one open for y'all. Because y'all know y'all be wanting to see that. Y'all be wanting to see that action. Y'all about that action. Y'all about that action. So you can always tell if your meat tender too when it pulls away from the bone like this. Do you guys remember that this meat was all the way down here? When it pulls all the way up like that, that's how you know you're working with something. So listen, let's bust open something. Let me, hold on y'all, let me zoom in. Let me zoom. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Make sure y'all can see. Okay, boom. Hold on, let me move that back. Bust open. Tender. Tender. Open. Boom. Y'all. So, oop, I done hit the thing. Y'all, so that's what it's hitting for. Very tender, as you can see. Look at that. So what I'm about to do oh, is, is taste it. I'm gonna taste it for to make sure the flavor is there and the flavor that I want is there so I'm going to taste this you guys I'm gonna taste it excuse me if I look sweaty I am outside having a great time it is beautiful weather here in Buffalo New York I'm chilling so look y'all this is my bite wait is that one of them y'all know turkey got them nah I thought it was one of them um, shards, but look, you guys, that is what my bite is going to look like, right? So, let me see. I don't know if y'all be able to see me take it, but hey, y'all. I hope y'all can see me. Probably not. Mmm. Oh God, oh my, oh God, dog it. This, ugh. you know how, let me get this back in the view. You know how something be so good that it make you mad? I'm pissed. This just made me real mad. Y'all, I'm not adding anything else to it. Let me put that fork down and let me just ladle. Oh, that's so good. Ladle some more juices on here. And then, y'all, I am going to pop these in the broiler on high. And, of course, I'm going to stand there and watch it because it's not going to take long. I'm going to put these in a broiler um, just to give it an extra little crisp. You know, because as you can see, that's nice and crispy. But, you know, the broiler is just going to, like, give it that, y'all know, that that nice brown, that crisp that we want. Especially this one over here. You know what I'm saying? So, these are so done. And let's get our turkey under the broiler. Stay tuned, y'all. This is what they are looking like. They got that char on there that I just love, love, love. So now, you guys, I'm just going to take that juice. And you can thicken up your juice if you want to. I'm actually a little lazy today. So we're not going to thicken this up. Okay? We're not going to thicken it up. But this is what it is looking like. And I'm just going to do this, you guys. I'm just going to ladle. I'm just ladling. Just ladling. Ladle. Ladling that juice on those turkey wings, you guys. And this is a up close. Again, nice and tender. That's the one we bust open. Bust it wide open. There we go. Tender, juicy. The luck the boat. Oh, oh my goodness, just tender meat going all over the place. But 
And you guys, what I'm going to do is plate this up for y'all. And I will be back with the final clip. Stay tuned. YouTube fam, wait a minute. Okay, wait. Here's the finished result, right? Here is a turkey wing on top of some rice, some delicious rice, may I add, that I created. But this is a finished result, y'all, and I'm about to make y'all laugh because why did I drag so much putting out the ending video that I almost did not even have a plate to even make y'all. Let me show you. Here is what's left. Y'all, dog. Look, that's it. I'm so happy I was able to scoop this joint up or y'all wouldn't even have the finished result. But y'all, <laughs> that's all that's left. That's it. This would have been the finished result right here. Done. That juice down there, look at that juice though. Flavor, flavor, woo, gravy. Y'all, this is what's left. I'm so happy, I, listen, I saved y'all one. This is what it came out to look like. It's, this is so funny to me. This is what it came out to look like, you guys. And it is, as you can see how I ripped it open earlier for you guys, nice and tender delicious this is like some um what can i call it spanish inspired rice that i because i got so frito in here some adobo some garlic i mean if you guys want to see the recipe on this rice let me know it is just like some goodness up in there and then of course i took that gravy that's over in there and I just poured it right on our turkey wing. Oh my goodness, y'all. So it was bomb. Like I said, I almost did not have any for you guys, but I definitely saved you guys some. And as always, I cannot wait to see you guys in the next video. Everybody stay safe and stay blessed. Mwah.